Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to learn new package Laravel GOIP. First of all, what features give us by this package? We can detect IP address and get location details using third party services. This package support multiple third party services. As you know, we learn about authentication log in last tutorial and authentication log package use this package as a dependency to capture the IP and locations. And here is the data you can see location is null and we set location holes into the authentication log configurations. Let me show you. This is false. And now I want to make true and capture location details. So I'm going to make it true, but it's not working because we need to install this package. So let's open official documentation of this package. Here is a repository and we can see getting started here. And you can see here, here is a composer required torrent GYP. So we need to install this package through the composer. And let's install this in my application. And it's successfully installed. We need to publish config. So, first of all, let's config publish with this command and it's copied into the config directory and you can see here one more step we need to do we need to add this class into the app.php so let's open and put it here it's a required step so do not forget to add and let's copy this and put it in alias array and let's save and then just need to compose the dump load because we We add it into the app.config so everything loaded properly. So I think installation is done and we are good in installations. Next step is we need to configure service because this package support multiple services. And here is the list you can use MaxMind, you can use IPO, IP geolocations. You use IP Finder, IP Data, IP API. Officially, all these services supported by this package. And if you want to use any other apart from this list, you can use. You just need to write custom service, and custom service code is also written in this documentation. You just need to copy paste and just need to change the service. URL and something and also how you can configure it's given here for the custom service for example you just need to change the base URL of the third party service which you want to use apart from this list so here I going to use this IP geolocation third party service I already created my account so let's sign in i'm going to sign with my google account so i'm going to use my google account for logging and 
you can see API key here. I just copy this API key and we need to put that key into the dot env. But let me show you. Here is all service max max mind IP geo locations. So we need to set this key in this key. So let's open and put this but copy this key name and put here and then we need to configure this service here so this package use by default this IP geolocation service and also you can set default locations this default location use when service try to retrieve any location through the IP address and not found that time this default location return so now I'm going to log in okay I need to run in the flow sorry now let me log out because it's already logged in and let's log in and let's refresh it and you can see this time location detail capture but my IP address is local was so not return anything just showing me look back address look back address means localhost address and you can see IP address but you can use uh, this package and service and deploy on your server and it's working fine uh, let me show some other examples how we can use this package let me close this and show you methods for example if you want to see ip address you can use this method let me show you home and here It's showing me local host IP and let's see location get location by IP address and I'm going to put here my current IP address based on my city and let's put it here there and then show you country city okay and then you can see my city same let me show you Full response of this get location method just refresh and you can see showing IP country code country name 
country capital, state, state code, city, zip code, latitude, longitude, everything, country code, country, domain, language, country flag, time zone, country, width, currency, currency code, currency symbol, everything. So giving huge details by this third party service and you can store it just based on the IP address. So you can use separately as well and I show you we can use as a dependency of that auth authentication log package. So that's it for today. Thank you for watching my video.